Frankfurt is a lot cosier than these cyclists from Hamburg ever imagined. They like the local apple wine, and they're proud that a German city could become the EU's new financial capital. It could have been Berlin or Hamburg, but there's more money here. It has nothing to do with size, it's all about competence and knowledge, and Frankfurt has what it takes. This is a record-setting location. It not only connects... No sooner had the British voted to leave the EU than marketing agency Frankfurt Mine Finance put up a website showing what the city has to offer, everything from tax advantages to English-language schools. The website aims to attract highly qualified staff from London to Frankfurt. The infrastructure is fantastic with the airport and we have the largest internet exchange point in Europe. 75% of our banks are international, 40% of residents come from other countries. It's a cosmopolitan city. But is Frankfurt really the new promising financial capital of Europe? The city has less than one million inhabitants. 70,000 people here work in the financial sector, compared to 700,000 in London. But there's one big attraction for foreign banks. The European Central Bank has its headquarters in Frankfurt. 10,000 bankers could move to Frankfurt, according to some estimates. They would need offices and homes. That might give another boost to the real estate market. Prices have already been rising for years. One real estate agent talked to bankers in London. He doesn't expect much. People say Germany is no longer a top location. It's all about labor laws, which are too strict. There are better locations in Poland or India. No matter how many banks might come, the Frankfurt Stock Exchange has already taken a big step. It would like to merge with the London Stock Exchange to be more powerful internationally. But the Germans are making demands. The headquarters should no longer be in London, but in Frankfurt. Still, brokers say Brexit is not a good thing. Brexit is the worst thing I could have imagined. It has completely unsettled the world. What's next for the EU? Could the EU totally fall apart? Nobody knows. One thing won't change, the apple wine in Frankfurt pubs. Come what may, people here know how to enjoy life.